And welcome back. This is Butler Scuba with another sick episode of Let's Play Super Mario RPG. When we last left off, we were in this room here. We were about to take on those three ghosts. I'll be right back after I have done that. Okay, now I'm back. Let's move on into this little thing here. Oh, I've already screwed this up. Okay, let's 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 remember what we're actually supposed to do here. Okay, we have to get all these coins. But not that lead one at the front there. Just, you know, get them all in a row before they disappear like those two there. And if you can do that right, then you solve the little puzzle here. So let's go ahead, leave, try it again. I'm not very good at this one. Once again, it's another, oh my gosh, trying to talk while sick and play the game is not a good idea. But I does it anyways. All right, we've got. There we go. No, no, I missed one. Oh, I was so close. This is not that hard of a puzzle. I mean, you know, getting the coins, and then, you know, just just simple timing and jumping ability, and I'm just absolutely failing at it. There we go. And I think that's it. Yes, it is. And for our reward, we get all those coins that we already got, which is, I think, useless for us now. Yes, it is. But we do get this hint, a memo left by Dagama. It has four consonants. Thank you, game, for that we got. Okay, there's six letters. Two of them are vowels. Oh, by the way, four of them are consonants. Oh, thanks, games. Thank, thanks, thank, did I say games? Like, there's more than one of them? Thanks, game. Okay, this one, I can't say I remember. Oh, okay. Oh, I see what to do here. Oh, but I have to leave the room to do it? That's lame. Okay. Boom. Done. We get a mushroom, which we can't hold, so I'm just gonna get rid of it because mushrooms are pretty much useless when I have max mushrooms and mid mushrooms and we get a le memo left by Van Doren two consonants are side by side okay at least two consonants are side by side okay uh oh this looks like hmm that barrel's a different color do you know what that means guys? that means you can move it haven't you guys ever played an RPG before? If it's a different color, you can interact with it. No. I, I want to go this way. There we go. And apparently the only way I can do that is to jump on it. I can't run with it. Alright, and then jump down this one. We get another healing mushroom. And... The R comes before the L. Didn't we already get that hint? You know what? I'm just going to save right here. Yes, override the save file, yes. Okay. Sunken shaft. And... Oh, okay. Well, excuse me for just one second here. Sorry, did have to cough again. Okay. Um, I know the word already. I do remember it. Um, it's actually... No, oh, I'll give you guys a second here to, to guess. No. All right. Uh, if you guys, you know, don't want to know, then just look away or whatever. I won't actually say it out loud. Uh, the game actually does that for me. All right. What do you have to say? Okay. So I have the word ready. Ah, shh. Nobody knows. It's a secret. I did actually remember that after a while, after <laughs> you know, after playing the game for how many years, and I still remember that. And now it's boss time, and we're taking on the tentacles so far. So let's go ahead and try to fuck with those. Oh, I should have done Geno Boost. What am I doing? I'll have to do that starting next turn. I'm hoping I can take out one of these tentacles first, though. Oh, I can. Oh, they do quite a bit of damage, though, don't they? We'll do a Geno Boost on Mario. 
Uh, I never, uh, I don't know if I went over that Gino got a new uh, special attack, which is the Gino Whirl, uh, mostly because I don't have the timing of that down, but if you do have the timing of the Gino Whirl down, it will actually do max damage, 999 damage. It's crazy. It's crazy. So we're going to go ahead and Gino boost everybody in the party. This is actually a lot longer boss fight than it looks like it will be right now. Trust me, that should be enough to finish it off. Yes, it is. Taking on the last tentacle here. And it got rid of Gino. Oh, you suck so much. Why aren't you dead yet, actually? You should be dead by now. That should definitely be enough to kill you. And Gino plops down in the party and he's shaking. He oh, tentacle rape, man. Oh, and they get a free shot. That's not cool. All right, so he's gonna go ahead and Gino boost himself, and then it's Peach's turn. Yes, so she's gonna go ahead and use a group hug on everybody. Um, I don't know if I've explained that thoroughly before. It does cure all status effects. I don't think there is a timing on that one though, because I've never been able to find one. Nice. And uh, freaking got rid of Gino again. Oh, and he's back and, and shivering. Thanks, game. I just cured that. Ah, uh, 302. And uh, you. Uh, it's Tentacle Raping the Princess off screen right now. That is not a cool game. Where's my princess? There's my princess. Now it can kill you. Not that I was really avoiding that altogether at all, anyways. And now we're moving on. Everybody does a huge ass jump. Everybody can jump as high as Mario, apparently. And now it's time for the actual boss. Up against the last tentacles here. Along with, I believe his name is King Calamari. Yes, that is what his name is. Mario's our biggest damage dealer right now, so let's go ahead and focus with him. Oh, does look like I need to use a group hug again. We'll do that soon. Plus, it's going to heal all the status effects. Which is always nice. Yay, group hug! One shot it. One shot it, Mario. 240, not good enough for it. Taking on. That should be enough for it, though. Yes, uh, I believe that was over 500 damage. Slap the crap out of it. A drain beam. Oh, this does not look fun. It doesn't heal him for that, does it? This isn't Pokemon drain, is it? That would suck. Uh, you don't want to... Uh, uh, if I remember right, there, this isn't... The, uh, the final boss fight, so you don't want to actually use up all your FP this this uh, this fight because there's another one after this. But man, he's he's got quite a lot of defense here because yeah, not that much damage is going down on him. Excuse me, just one second. All right. Let's go ahead and take on the Calamari Samoa. There we go, 168 damage. He bursts into a s the fountain of coins, I guess. And we get 34 experience, 100 coins. We can't really use the 100 coins, though. Mallow does level up, reaches level 12. And he will probably do in power this time. Not three, four, one. Yes, three. And only Mallow. Everybody else, what that? I got somehow transported. Sweet. Okay, let's move on. No! And I was wrong after you beat uh, King Calamari, your FP does come back, so go ahead and use that all you want in the fight. Let's go ahead and move past that dry bones. Aw, oh, bullet bills. Did I ever fight a bullet bill? Can't you fight a bullet bill? I want to fight a bullet bill. No, it, it's not letting me. 
Uh, I, I can't make it up there. Did I miss something? I did. I was supposed to go up here. I guess the bullet pills will knock you down then. It's not too hard to dodge though. Oh, more rats. Ah. Alright, let's move on before that rat catches up to me. See, look, he was close. Oh, I didn't think he'd go all the way down there, but he does! Okay, let's... How do I... What? What? Oh, we do have a new enemy here, so let's go ahead and show this fight. I didn't know there was going to be a fight behind there. I couldn't see. We're up against a Gorgon. Which I believe is, uh... If my Greek mythology is right, and it usually is actually, I'm surprised that I remember so much of it that I do. A Gorgon is actually um, what a Me what Medusa was, uh, but of course Medusa was the best one or whatever. So yeah, you know, weird. And I get an HP max, sweet, because he just got hit. And I I was thinking about healing him. So now we get to slap the crap out of a door. Good job, Peach. Apparently Mario is not as strong as I remember, and she doesn't die. She lives with one. I thought that was enough to kill her, but it's not. But that's enough to kill him. Nobody leveled up, though. Let's go ahead and heal up Toad's Gloss Green. All right. How do I get... Oh, I see what I have to do here. Do you guys see it? Huh. <gasps> Wait, where'd that rat go? I don't want to run into the rat. <gasps> no! Alright, let's try that again. <gasps> I, I can do this. How do I... Is there like something over... Oh! Duh. Ha! I figured it out. Oh, it's just coins anyways. And more coins. That once again are useless to us because apparently I have way too many coins right now. I don't know. Okay, what the hell? There's there's two Marios. Okay. Oh wait, I, I know there's some kind of trick to this. If I jump, right? But then... You know, I think I have to come in from this side. Okay, I, I've definitely screwed things up here a little bit. Let me try that again. Okay, what the hell? Okay, I cannot go diagonal, otherwise it screws this guy up. See? No, I know there's something in here. Okay, hold on, I'll have to look this up. How to get that done? I know it's in there somewhere. Alright, I do remember how to get it now. Well, not remember. I looked it up, because I don't think I've ever gotten this one before. Uh, there should be a block around here. Yes, there it is. So we need this Mario as close to this as we can, and... No. Almost had it. Almost had it. No, get back here, Mario! All right, there we go. And for our trouble, we get a Caro Caro Cola, which is definitely worth the trouble. Uh, so we're gonna get rid of the pure water to make room for it. Oh, I never actually explained that lucky jewel. Um, this lucky jewel here. Uh, you know, this does uh, damage to uh, party or the enemy. Sorry, it doesn't do damage to your party. Uh, shiny stone. We do need that for an optional end game boss, I, I believe it is. And then this. Um, lucky Jewel summons luck at will. What it does is um, it automatically gives you a lucky, the same as if uh, you got it during battle. And um, that way, you know, you can double your coins or your experience. Um, but it does look like that is all the time that I have. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Let me just hide behind this thing so I don't get in a fight. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Um, sorry that I've been sick 
Um, so the commentary is probably not as good as usual. Oh, it's okay, but I'll just go. We hate your commentary, anyways. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Um, so hopefully, I'll feel better in time for Fallout 3 because I do try to record those in one massive set at a time and I don't want to give you guys a week's worth of Fallout 3 videos with a voice like this uh, but hope you guys have enjoyed this part hope you laughed hope you learned hope to see you next time thanks for watching <laughs>